yeah, taking into consideration the plight of the migrant labor who got stranded in uh, AP uh, and also the people of AP stranded in other states, uh, Government of Andhra Pradesh uh, has taken various uh, initiatives. Honorable Chief Minister has given clear directions that uh, the uh, stranded migrant labor from Andhra Pradesh uh, to various uh, states like Bihar, UP, Rajasthan, uh, uh, Jharkhand, Chhattisgarh, Orissa, they need to be sent uh, properly by arranging uh, buses uh, to the ceramic trains and also meeting the expenditure of ceramic trains uh, by Government of Andhra Pradesh. So this is the initiative which the Government of Andhra Pradesh has taken. Uh, where uh, the entire expenditure related to movement of this uh, uh, the migrant level uh, from their places to the uh, uh, ceramic trains and also uh, the cost uh, uh, being incurred in the ceramic train along with food expenditure is being uh, uh, taken by the government of Andhra Pradesh. So this will be a huge expenditure uh, almost we have already spent around 30 crores on movement of uh, uh, the people across the state uh, to make them reach the uh, ceramic trains. So in addition to that, uh, Honorable CM also has depend, uh, seeing the plight of the people uh, walking long distances uh, from uh, uh, Tamil Nadu, Tal Telangana, Karnataka and other states uh, and going through Andhra Pradesh to various destinations of Bihar, UP, Orissa, uh, Jharkhand, Chhattisgarh and all. So, uh, because uh, this is a very hot uh, uh, sun and uh, uh, going uh, that many kilometers, thousands of kilometers by walk is definitely not uh, good for health and also uh, seeing their desperation to reach their native places, uh, Honorable CM has uh, taken a decision to engage the RTC buses to, uh, to stop all these people, counsel them uh, at uh, the relief centers and making arrangement for their onward journey by ceramic trains or buses. Uh, so what he has given direction is uh, we will transport all the people of neighboring states like Orissa, Chhattisgarh uh, uh, by RTC buses, uh, duly dropping them, uh, coordinating with the district administration of the neighboring states at the neighboring district. So uh, almost last three days we have, ta we have almost stopped around 4,600 people going on uh, walk. And out of them, almost 2,000 people belonging to Orissa are being transported at government expenditure by organizing buses uh, from the relief centers uh, to the uh, Ganjam district. Similarly, another 600 people we are transporting to Chittisgarh uh, to the Bastar district, our uh, border. So all other people who, are, who have to travel for very long distances like Bihar, UP, uh, Rajasthan, uh, uh, West Bengal, uh, all these people now we are prioritizing their journey through the ceramic trains. Uh, we have already uh, moved around 31 uh, ceramic trains as on today. Uh, today we are moving another 5 ceramic trains, tomorrow another 5 and next one week another 30 ceramic trains are being organized. So all these people who are uh, uh, stopped uh, while walking will be attached to the ceramic train uh, meeting the expenditure of moving them from the relief center to the ceramic trains uh, from government of Andhra Pradesh. So uh, this is a great uh, help uh, for the people who are in desperation uh, and uh, uh, psychologically prepared to walk such a long distances with family, children, women and uh, the older persons. So this uh, we are making it uh, very systematically. We have given uh, two circular instructions to all the collectors and SPs to ensure that all these people are given proper help. So similarly, the people who are uh, stranded within the state, inter-district movement also is an issue uh, because public transport is not there. So we have transported around 1,9,000 people from RTC buses, through RTC buses from one district to another district such that they reach their uh, uh, districts uh, very uh, safely uh, and without uh, problem. So all this we are also ensuring that uh, the proper testing is done whenever the uh, interstate movement take place uh, such that the disease is not spread and only uh, asymptomatic persons are only being sent, uh, symptomatic persons being shifted to the uh, COVID care centers or COVID hospitals.